I love eating chips. They are mouth-watering, making you want more and more after taking a bite. They are also a good complement with alcohol whenever you feel like a sad boy by hating them that much. Like this guy. Many months later. <laughs> Not on that, they are cheap, making it affordable to the mass and irresistible at the same time. A great combination indeed between chips and cheap. In business world, being cheap is a strategy usually implemented by Chinese businessmen. Saying it doesn't matter how small your profit is as long as it is consistent. But the problem is, if every one of us follow the advice of this Chinese businessman without having the capital they do, would our business become profitable as these Chinese people if every one of us follows the same rule and strategy? A. Yes. B. No. C. Maybe. B is your answer, you are right. Because being cheap when you have only a small capital and a mouth to fed is never a good idea. That is why B different. Instead of trying to make your product cheap like chips, focus on adding value to your product by improving your packaging, innovating, or studying what your customer really needs and want. You see, many starting entrepreneurs are so fixated about having the cheapest price in the area that they tend to neglect what their customer really needs. Forgetting that business is not a competition of having the cheapest product in the area but a race of innovation on how to better serve and satisfy your customer's ever-changing needs. The thing is, aiming to make your product cheap as chips is not a bad advice. If you have millions or billions of capitals, like Pure Gold or Walmart, but if you don't have such high capital, focus on providing convenience and value to your customers. Continue innovating day by day to better the life of everyone. And when your business suddenly booms, don't forget that everything you have comes from above. That is all in this week's video. Let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below. React and share this video if you agree. Remember, Kansas, let us all keep growing together. See you next week.